If you want to use any of the data analysis tools in Excel, what you need to first do is go to the data tab here. What you're hoping to see is in the upper right corner here, there would be a little box that said data analysis. If you don't see that, then you're going to have to enable it. So here's how you do it. First, click on this office button in the top left. What you need to do is go down here to Excel options. When you're in Excel options, there's lots of things you can change. So for example, you can change how many sheets are included in a new workbook or what font you start with. So there's lots of things you can play around with here. But what we want is over here on the left in add-ins. This gives you a list of everything you've currently got. We need to manage those. So go down here where it says manage add-ins and click go. This is a list of all the things that you could possibly do. Uh, all you need to do on this one is the analysis tool pack. This will help you for regressions and histograms and random number generations and all kinds of things like that. Once you click that, you'll see instantly this data analysis tab shows up. And from here, you can do all the stuff you want. Correlation, random numbers, regression, testing, all kinds of things. If you are using a a uh, lab computer, for example, that hasn't had the data analysis enabled, then just follow those steps and then you'll enable it. Once that's done once, you shouldn't have to do it any longer. It should remember that it's always there.